What it is, y'all, it is your old boy Pilgrim. I'm coming back at you today with more Damashi. Now, we don't have any new banners coming in tonight, but we do have a couple data mines. Not a crazy amount to talk about, but we are going to talk about a little bit of something here. Uh, because tomorrow, or tonight, technically, uh, as of releasing this, we are going to be getting the new Heroic Trial. Now, I always say the assist is like the best thing to go after here, but Nagisa, I, I, I really don't know. So thunder attack damage and wind attack damage and counter rate 20 yeah you want this unit if you got anybody off these new banners you really 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 want that nagisa bond now for the sake of argument if you are for whatever reason not going to be chasing her uh kojo's not a bad unit by any stretch of the imagination now let's go and pull up his information here because i just don't completely remember he does an allies fast thunder attack damage, counter rate, and guard rate, plus 50%. That's good news. Uh, notice there's no strength buff there, though. And self three actions, low thunder magic attack. Skill two is a fast mid thunder magic attack with temporary magic boost and allies 70% or 75% null physical attack. That's going to be really good in war game coming up. And uh, foes plural for skill three, high thunder magic attack with strength magic and a dex down 30%. Basically, this dude's, like, made for war game. Um, but Nagisa's made for, like, everybody that's on the banner. So now I always say you're better off getting the assist bond from the Heroic Trial only because they're a little more expensive to come by if you do decide to buy the Star Bond. Or, I'm sorry, yeah, the Star Bonds in her case. So make some rational decisions. Though, honestly... I wouldn't blow all your star bonds on these uh, crossover units. They're good. Most units are very good. But remember, we're like two months away from the start. As, actually, as of today, we're like, what, a month and a day? Two, two days, two months and a day away from, not two days, thank goodness, away from the beginning of the big JP anniversary. So save some of those gnome tickets. Save some of those star bonds. Just throwing that out there right now. Now, that's Heroic Trial. You can kind of choose what you want to do with that. Of course, the uh, the amulet and the gem up there. Uh, the amulet, you collect 600 of those. You trade it for the gem. The gem is what's going to give you a free bond. I haven't really talked about this in the previous videos because I mean, we talked about it so much more before. But it has come up recently. Just a general reminder, guys. You can only pick one and only one bond out of the Heroic Trial. you got to make... Got to make a solid decision there. Uh, I think Nagisa is a better choice. Just like I said, she's a little harder to come by if you do have to buy the the star bonds. But uh, they're both really solid. They're really both great units. Uh, next up is an interesting thing here. This is the asset that we have for um, that new combo attack. The uh, the wealth and uh, Kojo combo attack. If you didn't see that, I actually dropped a video on that uh, yesterday. You can actually see the combo attack there. But this is all the assets. This is actually pretty sweet. There's a lot here uh, in regard to that. So, actually, if, yeah, a few more over here. So, here's where you get, like, the different wealth heads and the swords with the different animations. So, a lot went into this combo attack. This combo attack, look at this. And there's Kojo's side of the combo attack. There is a ton of assets in this combo attack. That is why it looks so damn good. If you haven't seen the combo attack, go back and look at yesterday's uh, uh, video where we talked about all the news and everything. Uh, the combo attack looks absolutely stellar. Uh, and I'm going to try out Wealth. I do have Wealth maxed out. We haven't had a chance to really give him a good shot yet, but... Hopefully I can come up with something today that we can damage test him and kind of get an idea of how well he works. So, fingers crossed on that. Of course, the Heroic Trial. Nothing surprising there. Uh, I don't know what that is, though. I really don't know what that is. That actually uh, could be something coming up for another one of the episodes, just a random cell here. And I was warned of this. This actually could be for one of the new Sword Oratoria uh, levels that we might be getting later on. We're not getting any this week, uh, but sometimes you add these things in a little bit early. Okay, next cell is all about Heroic Trials once again. Now, after this point, we might be getting into some potential spoilers. So if you have not finished the story, which 
I'm going to look a little bit like a fool here. I have not yet, but you guys know I've been on vacation, so I was kind of holding off on that. Let's get into it. True Familia Royale. Okay, there's another heroic trial thing there. So True Familia Royale, as you guys know, this is like the uh, sort of like record buster. Uh, you're just basically trying to accrue the most damage you can. Uh, but you gotta, you could beat the foe, and you could beat them within a certain amount of time. And then remember, every couple of days a new le level opens up. Just try to go for the highest uh, damage output you can on each level on each day. Now, foe number one is going to be this dragon. So you can bet dragon killers is going to be uh, effective. The next one is going to be this foe. And this foe, they did say that spirit killer is most effective here. Foe number three is the big spoiler. You've been warned. Foe number three is witty. Uh, looks like she's got mm, corrupted. I haven't read the story. I don't know what's up with that. We're just going to have to see. But yeah, looks like she's corrupted in some way. So uh, time for me to go through the story personally. But that is the data mines, guys. This is just some general art. Uh, you can bet this is going to start working its way into the uh, the thumbnails. In fact, I believe I'm going to go ahead and use that Yukina for this thumbnail. But that's that, guys. Let me know what you thought in the comments section down below. Kind of a short one today. But, you know, we don't have a huge amount to talk about. I mean, it's just pretty straightforward. There's not even any, like, new assets, no new gotchas, no nothing like that. We in, we out, we on with our lives. Like, comment, share. Remember, your mom asks where I've been. I'm on my way back from the store any minute now. Any, uh, uh, I had to cross a few state lines to get that milk. Don't don't send a search party. <laughs>